Hi everybody, it's Dr. Rada with West Valley Naturopathic Center. This month we are talking about heavy metals and heavy metal exposure. I wanna talk about lead and osteoporosis. I work with a lot of perimenopausal, postmenopausal women, and so osteoporosis is a very important concern of ours. And lead can be a component of our risk of developing osteoporosis. So what is lead? Well, lead's a, a metal, and if you are perimenopausal, postmenopausal age, or men in your 50s and up, we were exposed to a lot of lead when we were younger. And lead was found like an old paint, uh, pipes, lead pipes, gas. Uh, if you've worked in construction, metalworking, you might have been exposed. We have contaminated water, contaminated soil that will have heavy uh, or high doses of lead in them. Uh, also, things that we get from overseas oftentimes are imported toys, cosmetics, jewelry will have a higher level of lead in them. And so what lead does in the body is it is stored like 90 to 95% in the bones. It replaces calcium and that lead interferes with bone remodeling. So it's not uh, broken down appropriately. It's not rebuilt appropriately. It doesn't stay as strong. And so that sets you up for a higher risk of osteopenia or osteoporosis. With osteoporosis, we have a higher risk of fractures, right? Uh, things that we can do, uh, chelation will help bring this out, right? IV, we would do uh, heavy metal testing. We do an IV challenge, do heavy metal testing, and then chelation therapy to help bring it out, uh, lower our lead levels. Uh, if you're above the age of 50, you're at higher risk. If you have a history of known exposure, if you've lived in older homes or worked in older buildings, say, you know, before the night, late 1970s, 1980, uh, you may have been exposed to a lot of lead. Also, poor diet, smoking, um, any history of fractures, or if you've already been diagnosed with osteopenia or osteoporosis, you are at a higher risk, right? Uh, so what you want to do is set up an appointment with one of our providers, talk about heavy metal exposures. Uh, we would do a kind of a good history on where you may have been exposed to things, do a heavy metal challenge test, see if that lead is causing a problem. We would also do things like a DEXA or a bone scan to see if you have osteopenia or osteoporosis already. Uh, and then we would check things like your vitamin D level, your calcium level, both of those are very important when it comes to bone health and can play a big part in protecting you against the, the damage that lead can do in the bones. So have your appointment set up with your naturopath here and we will take a look at your heavy metal burden, see what kind of risks we're at, do a heavy metal challenge test and kind of go from there, all right. I uh, hope you guys have a wonderful 4th of July. It is our July uh, issue of our magazine and so <laughs> of our newsletter, excuse me. So I hope you have a wonderful summer and come and see us. Take care.